So a quick tip for, for all you practicing saxophonists out there. One thing that you can add to your arsenal of techniques is to use a double lip embouchure when you're working on long tones, altissimo passages, articulation exercises, anything really. Um, a double lip embouchure is when you take your upper lip and roll it over your upper teeth in addition to rolling your bottom lip over your bottom teeth. Um, many of us will play single lip, which just has your teeth on the top of the mouthpiece instead of the lip. But with double lip, I find uh, that it brings, brings a little bit more awareness to a couple of different issues. One of those things being biting. Now a lot of young students will clamp down on the mouthpiece just a little bit too much on the mouthpiece and the reed. And with the double lip embouchure, you are hyper aware of how much pressure you're putting on the mouthpiece and reed themselves just because you're a little bit more in touch uh, with your body in that way. Another way that um, double, the double lip embouchure helps, and one thing that many people don't think about, is that when you're playing with a double lip embouchure, you're actually a little bit more aware of your own finger technique. So when every time you move a finger, um, you can kind of feel the, the instrument move into your mouth. That's with a double lip embouchure. Now, if I was using the double lip embouchure and using way too much finger tension, this is what that might look like. So I can already feel it just kind of uh, the instrument moving around in my mouth and it gets really, really uncomfortable. So it's a, that's another benefit of using the double lip embouchure. And, and finally, I would just say, possibly most importantly as well, um, that double lip allows you to really focus on your voicing. So if you're practicing altissimo passages and you really need to develop some consistency and accuracy with your, with your, with your practice, try using a double lip embouchure. You might be surprised at um, how much you might miss notes here and there uh, just because your, your tongue's not in the right position. Uh, and I'll, I will also say that when you're working double lip into your practice, you'll want to do it very, very incrementally because we're trying to build up our muscle of the upper lip there. And so I would recommend starting with maybe five minutes uh, at the most, maybe five minutes per day for a week, and then add five minutes as you go. So uh, actually now in my personal practice, I, I want to be able to play almost all of my repertoire with a single lip and a double lip embouchure. And I'll also say that when I do go to perform, I'm primarily using the single lip embouchure. So double lip is mainly a practice technique for, for all of you out there. Thanks so much.